But Professor Yap believes is not the direct impact we should be worried about. And there are three stages to the collision. Stage one is when there is a direct impact between the rider and the pedestrian. And stage two is when the pedestrian falls to the ground and possibly hit the head on the ground. And if the pedestrian is really unlucky, then there's a stage three where the rider, PMD rider, could land on top of the pedestrian and crushing uh, him or her. So actually it's a triple whammy. Basically what you have shown me here is like uh, the anatomy of a collision. At which stage is it most dangerous to the pedestrian? So the most dangerous is stage two, where the pedestrian mm. uh, falls to the ground. This is where the head is most uh, sustainable to a critical injury because as it's the highest point of the uh, body. So as the body falls, the head will hit the ground probably at a speed around 15, 20 or even higher kilometers per hour. Okay. So that level of uh, speed will cause a uh, a force that is equivalent to 1.5 to 2 tons of force. I see. Okay, so we are in your laboratory. You have something to show me to demonstrate um, the, the extent of the damage uh, of injury that this can cause. Yes, uh, let me show you. Okay. 